the overall experience was very good in these seven modules because we had very dedicated teams from local communities across Nepal. We believed firmly that uh, communities are capable of understanding and responding to conflicts on natural resources in more constructive ways. And over the last 18 months, we found that this was not only true, but we discovered and learned many things about how this might work in the Nepali context. People were very committed and brought back each time their uh, learning and their finding. And I think we developed some good new approaches to conflict transformation at the community level on natural resource issues. Every international setting has its own unique setting and culture. I find uh, that especially when you're working at the local grassroots community level, in many countries around the world, these are people who are far from the capital cities and may not have as much advantage. And so there are some similarities. What I, one of the similarities certainly is the people's interest in finding more creative ways to respond to conflicts that affect their lives. In the Nepali setting, um, we found some very interesting things about how people work at community levels and how they often organize around uh, organizations and families and especially in the Nepal context, uh, the 10 years of the civil war uh, and the hardships that people suffered created a lot of, of um, movement. There were uh, a lot of issues around forestry and water were on the topic of encroachment. And I found especially unique the ways that people who were from the communities were able to work constructively with new arriving groups that often would create uh, more explosive conflicts at times. They really found a way to transform those in very interesting and constructive ways here in, here in Nepal. Nepal's capacity for opening uh, their arms to, to embrace a, a bigger family, I think is especially uh, interesting for the rest of the world to, to see and to understand. So it was a unique and has been a unique experience in many ways. The political situation has been very difficult in Nepal and I'm often struck that the, the politicians approach to conflict is to guard their territory very hard and to only reach consensus at the very last minute. And this often puts um, many people in peril. <clears throat> it makes it very difficult to reach agreements. What I find at the local community level is that the, the more that we can encourage and empower local communities to believe that they have a capacity to respond to their situations, the stronger the local communities are, the less I think there will be manipulation of the communities by the higher political levels. And I think that's one of the long-term challenges of Nepal, to strengthen the, the local community so that there is more accountability from the leadership, whether that be at a community level or a higher political level in Nepal. So it's a long journey ahead, uh, but I'm very much encouraged uh, to be honest, more by what I'm seeing happening at the community level sometimes than what I see happening at the formal political level. It seems to have such difficulty reaching the